up dolphins right off the bat. They always feed along the edge of these mangroves. They're doing the same thing that guy over there is. Yep, everybody's out here it's looking. Oh, well, that's a, it's the same ones we saw last week. <laughs> same, oh, right here, right down here in front of us. That is so cool. They go, you just don't know where they're gonna pop up. Anyway, good evening, my friends. Where'd they go? Come on, Captain Sandy. Oh, they're gonna come up. Put me on point here. Right in front of the boat. There go. Right there. So, right in front of the boat. Oh, I see. Your eyes peeled here. Here, here. Mm. It's just the same ones we saw when you were out here last time. That's uh, Dolly and Margaret. <laughs> that is, Dolly's is a great restaurant in Benita. <laughs> Oh. Yeah. They're like hanging out right over here by the side of the boat. Where the heck did they go? Behind us now. Two hanging up right yeah. over there. He's coming towards us. See if we see him over here. Yeah. Huh. Well, there's a couple over here. It's just what happened the last time we were out here. Come on, dolphins, where are you at? That's what it's all about: boat naples and dolphins and slunch Irish whiskey. <laughs> oh, right, right there. Oh, just, oh, right there. Oh, right right there. Oh. Right it's going right over that way. <laughs> you still know. <laughs> it's like toast. Boom. Oh, there it is. Right there. Boom. Oh, there it is. It's leading the way there. Oh. That sun is blinding right now. I can't say. Yep. Yep. How sweet. How sweet. Seeing a dolphin is good luck, my friends. They are a good luck charm. Hit that share button. It's a beautiful night. Windy. Very breezy. Yeah, it is warm. But man, clear night. It was clear all day today. Sunny day. Captain Sandy, man, what'd you do? Three, four trips today, Sandy? You were like swamped. It's amazing how many people come out. It was actually <laughs> It's like, you're, it's amazing. <laughs> Everybody gets word of oh. Boat Naples and boom. All right, we're going to go. There's, we're going to come back here for a sunset. Yep. 
They're still hanging out over there, I'm sure. Anyway, by a welcome aboard for another fantastic sunset cruise with Boat Naples. We got my big friend Robert over here, my bodyguard. <laughs> and we got Jay and Kay over here. Hello, guys. Hi. Beautiful night, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Wonderful. Man. And we got the queen of the sea right here. <laughs> Captain Sandy. The best. The best. Boatnables.com. Boatnables. That's all she knows how to say. She's like a parrot. Boatnables.com. She doesn't say anything else. Boatnables.com. <laughs> I don't know anybody's name back here. Oh, that's okay. But this is, um, what's his name over here? And that's those two ladies over there. I don't know their names. Cindy and Margaret. Cindy and Margaret. Margaret. And Tony, Sandy's friend, Tony. It's going to be a fun night. It's going to be a very fun night. So, start out with a bang, right? Dolphins right off, right off the start. That's the best Man, it's going to be an awesome evening. We're just going to do our little thing here. We're going to do our little backwater cruise here. This is actually the backside of Del Norwegian's Pass State Park all along here. Rumor has it that someday they're going to actually have a boardwalk in the park that brings you to the backside of the park here. I'm looking forward to that. A lot of new things in store for Del Norwegian's. It's not a rebuilding, it's a rebirthing of the park. Keep the faith, my friends. Keep the faith. We did lose our park manager, Ranger T. Terrence. That's sad. Sad to see him go, but you know, he had other things he had to take care of. We miss him. Can't wait to meet our new park ranger. Don't know who it's going to be yet. This is, I love this view right here. I love it, I love it, I love it, right here. This is my favorite. Looking across this little lagoon area here. It's actually in Del Norwegian's Pass State Park. You don't even know it's there. Isn't that beautiful? Is that not gorgeous? Minus the canopy of the boat there. I just think that's so beautiful. It is beautiful. It's still breezy out here. I don't know what the temperature is. Probably mid 70s right now. Tide's on its way out, so we're going against the current right now. Straight ahead of us, just to the right of that condo over there, that is the Bluebell Avenue Bridge, way off in the distance there. I call that the Bridge to Paradise, the Bridge to Del Norway, and it's also the Bridge to the North End of Vanderbilt Beach. Look at that sky. Look at that sky. You look at that and you're like, wow, you know what? It can get bluer than that. It actually can get bluer, but not much. Hit that share button. Come on, my friends. It's going to be a great night. Clear skies. Wonderful people on board and watching. Y'all are awesome. Send some stars if you're liking what you're seeing. We got another hour ahead of us here.
That's the dunes. If you're familiar with North Naples, all these condos are the dunes. And the reason they're called the dunes is because back in the old days, when I actually first came over here to Naples, these were dunes all along here. It was a 50-50 mix of man-made dunes and natural dunes. When they dredged out all the canals for Connors and everything, they piled up sand there, but it was a lot of natural dunes. You could actually take, back then we didn't have four-wheelers, you had three-wheelers, you could jump the dunes. There were bald eagle nests back in there. Well, it's a concrete jungle. <laughs> Spoil paradise, but whatever. It is what it is. Eventually, Florida is just going to be one big concrete mess along the beach. <laughs> Enjoy it while you can. Enjoy the journey, as our Captain Roy would always say. So over here to the right, this is where the boat launch is, the boat ramp for Del Norwegians. There's a, another little lagoon over here. Maybe Captain Sandy will take us in there and get a peek at it. We'll see. See if I have any influence. Let's, let's go back in that little spot there for a second. Show them the boat launch and It's actually an incredible. It's really a secret, and I'm probably gonna get in trouble for sharing this with you. But I'm gonna show you one of the best little fishing holes up here in North Naples. Now it's private property, so you can't get in there. You either have to have a boat or live in these things. <laughs> these big condos. But all Back in here is a little lagoon. Again, this is all Del Norwegian's Pass State Park over here. But over in here is some unbelievable fishing. Unbelievable fishing. Fish just come in here to feed. Dolphins come in here to feed on the fish that are feeding. I know there's going to be a lot of people ticked off at me for letting this cat out of the bag. <laughs> but it's all about the tides, too. you got to be here at the right time. And I'm not going to tell you about what time. If you're a fisherman, you know what time is the best time to be fishing. I'm just showing you where there's a really good yeah, spot. There's a dolphin right there. Dolphin. Oh. Yep. Dolphins. The yep. Dolphins are in here feeding. A dolphin just popped up over there. See, I wasn't lying. <laughs> this is a gold mine back here for fishing. But of course, all along the seawall is private property. So unless you live here, I can't be back here. You have to come in here by boat. There's one little spot at Del Norwegians you can fish from. We'll show you that on the way back out here. Tell them, say boatnaples.com. So, Captain Sandy, how. How high did the water get here on the back of these condos? Uh, so did it make it up to the... This condo uh -huh. um, did not get more than two inches in it. Two inches of water in this that one. Condo That's condo to the right? Oh, yeah. Look at the difference. Seven feet. This one's up on a mountain yep. compared to that. Seven feet of water in this condo. Yep. Two inches in this one. Two one inches. Uh, up, right up to the second floor. Right up to the second floor, the, the water came. 
the storm surge of her Hurricane Ian there. Hmm. Pretty wild, isn't it? All right. So again. It's all Del Norwegian's past state park, all over here at the back side of it. Most people don't get to see this part of the park. Falcon just popped up here somewhere. Serene back here. So quiet back here. You can hear the waves. <laughs> you can hear the waves in the Gulf over there. That's all they ever do is feed. Yeah. <laughs> they don't do anything but eat. They're eating machines. I mean, they dolphins play with their food. It's hysterical to watch them throw. They take their fish and throw them up in the air. Really? Yeah. yeah. It sucks to it sucks to be a fish. <laughs> yeah. Throw them out of the water. Yeah. play with a stick one time. <laughs> <laughs> it's hilarious. That's so cool. You know, I, I honestly believe the dolphins know. There they are. There it is. Oh, That's kind of shallow. Too. Yeah. They know, they know what they're doing. They know when oh, you're yeah. pointing a camera at them. They, I mean, they know. So that's the dock there, Del Norway. And there's like all kinds of little mangrove snapper all along here. They just, I don't know if they're, I don't know if they're a meal for a dolphin or not. <laughs> there's the dock. In case you didn't know, that is the dock at Del Norwegian's Pass State Park. Right there, and the boat ramp. Man, it is absolutely gorgeous. I wish you were out here with us this evening. And you could be. Just a phone call away, boatnaples.com. These sunset cruises are kind of a secret. You gotta give them a call to get on board with us. This is one of the very few times that we do group tours on Thursday evenings like this. Just gives a lot more people an opportunity to come out, a single person, a couple. The best deal going in all of Southwest Florida. Complimentary beer and wine. So now we're in the shadows of some of these condos. But straight ahead, if you squint your eyes there, that's the Bluebell Avenue Bridge. We're probably gonna 
maybe go under it, I don't know. And then head out Wiggins Pass for sunset. Anybody watching that's been out here with us before? Is there anybody online with us here that's been out for a sunset cruise with us? Let me see some hearts if that's a yes. There you go. Oh, it was windy this morning at the beach. You guys have no idea how windy it was during my beach walk this morning. Finally got the wind problem figured out on the microphone here for the iPhone. Oh, he just took off one of our great blue herons. Really? They got all pissed off at me for doing this last time. Who did? These people. Who did? Oh yeah. I've got hate mail and everything. What people? What? Yeah. So screw them. <laughs> Anyway, this is public waterway. Right. <laughs> now, they're just being jerk offs. I don't know who would have complained, but this is public. Anyway, this is the marina at the Vanderbilt Towers. Making a good comeback after the hurricane. A strong comeback. This was ugh, a mess after Hurricane Ian. I mean, there are boats stacked up on top of each other. It's unbelievable. Not even a year and a half ago. You need to go back and do some Googling and see what just North Naples looked like after Hurricane Ian. Vanderbilt, Vanderbilt Drive, Gulf Shore, oh my gosh. It's amazing how the rebuilding is going and people are just so impatient, they have no clue. And there's our favorite bridge. Last week I actually did a little walk under the bridge, a little video walk. I call it a walking tour under the bridge and through the park there. Connor Park. No fishing from the bridge. No jumping, no diving. Now, I'm not going to say people haven't jumped off that bridge. I know some people that have jumped off that bridge personally in their younger years. But I'm not going to mention any names. Quite a thrill. There's another good spot to go fishing right here. And also, you can 
see dolphins coming in and out, manatees, stingrays. Man, I've seen some awesome stingrays under this bridge. But that's all Connor Park over in there. Beautiful little walking path. It's a three quarter mile like looped walking path. If you're into walking in the morning and you don't want to go on the beach if it's windy or whatever, Connor Park is the place to do it. Walkway from here. Yep. The little benches there. And there's a little peek into the park. And this empty lot here, that's where Captain Sandy and I are gonna build our dream house right there. Said that you and I are building our dream house together oh, yeah. on that empty awesome. lot right there. Nice. <laughs> uh, sorry, Michael. I, uh, you're probably the last one to know. <laughs> Is that Vanderbilt Road up there? Yes. So we're on a long golf tour. Right. When I drive up that road, I can look down and see this. So something I did not know until. Eh, about two weeks ago, I did a little little research. I, was, I really never knew what this waterway was called back here on the back side of Vanderbilt Beach. And these little bays, I thought each of these little bays had a name. And I was quite surprised when I looked at the marine map. It says, this is just called the Vanderbilt Canal. <laughs> Not very sexy sounding or anything, the Vanderbilt Canal. Huh. Those lots, they, they start at three million. <laughs> These are just incredible homes here. Incredible. If you need to ask how much they cost, well, you know the old rule. So if it says market price on the menu. Thanks for the stars, I appreciate that. Yeah, wherever you see an empty lot here, it's because the house has been torn down. That's because it got flooded out by Hurricane Ian. Obviously, this is prime real estate. That share button. Come on, my friends. Where is everybody at here? It's beautiful out here. Never trust him and said she said no, she's the biggest mistake she ever made. 
Now we're heading into the wind. That wind's still coming out of the north. It was all mangrove. Yeah. This was all mangrove here before, and then they just trashed it and built this. <laughs> so. Yep, development. It's wonderful. Pretty to look at. <laughs> So we're making our way north, Clumsky. up the Vanderbilt Canal, heading up okay. towards the Coquihatchee River, and we're going to hang out at Wiggins Pass for sunset if you're just tuning in. Boatinnaples.com. I'd love to see you on board with us one Normally it's a Thursday evening. We got kind of weathered out yesterday evening. Very windy. Still breezy, but. Our friend Doni texting me during a live feed. Interesting. Everything's all right. He had, he was 14 or 15 already, 13. So anyway, 17 foot runabout. Here we go back oh, under the bridge. A Thunderbird, fiberglass boat with a big motor on the back. Yeah. Those are awesome boats. The, big boat the old Thunderbirds. I had, I had a Thunderbird. Huh? The, the boat, the yeah. Thunderbird, yeah. a tri hull. Yeah. Yep. Just talking, just people trading stories here. I've been around Florida for a long time, my friends. A long time. All but. All but two years of my life. I lived in Florida. Seen a lot of changes. Man. I went down one day after I was grew up in Miami. Back in the 90s. I went I took my friend down Twenty plus years in Miami, then I had enough. Came over here. So we talked to him and he remembered people. They really liked he liked my mom and dad real well. Nothing. None of this was over here. There was a couple little condos. The little Towers over there, over there. None of this stuff was here. None of these big condos. Heck, Del Nor Wiggins Pass State Park wasn't even here. He went to some. That was just went to some big piece of land. <laughs> Amazing. Up in New England. He was a. We used to come over here in the early 1960s from Miami. Now, we wouldn't come up to North Naples. There was nothing to see up in North Naples. We would shoot across US 41, the Tamiami Trail, and wind up down by the Naples Pier. 
It was amazing. Absolutely amazing. Small houses, none of these big mansions there yet. That little white fish, that little white bird up there, you got two fish just now. I guess they say change is good. Oh, okay. I don't know. Change is good. Oh, okay. Yeah. Until the next hurricane comes along. <laughs> in here. Got his slancha hat. There you go. Del Norwegians. I love that view right there. If you've been on a live feed or on board with us, you know that's I love that view. That sun just peeking over the treetops. there. Absolutely gorgeous. Could be you, my friends. BoatNaples.com. Love to have you out here with us. Best captain in Naples. Bouncing the camera around. We already went under it again. Yeah. At the 
my favorite spot here. Check it out. I love these views. The sun setting. This little lagoon up here. One of my favorite views right here. It's like a little reveal. Comes the sun. See it twinkling there on the left through the trees. Man. Look at that. Spectacular. I call that the money shot right there. That's like great for photography with a couple boats out here. don't even know how you get to that from the interior of Del Norwegian's Pass State Park. I'm not exactly sure where that little lagoon is. Beautiful clear sky, look at that. sitting over here in their boat. I don't know if there's some dolphins over here. That's where we saw the dolphins when we first came out this evening. All back in here. Wiggins Pass over here to the left. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Another night in paradise, wouldn't you say? They're still yeah. hanging out over here. Right coming towards us. Look down a little bit, Rob. Some dolphins coming towards us here. The car boat's watching us. Oh! oh. Yeah. There they are. <laughs> coming right for us. <laughs> oh, that's a baby. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the moving tiki boat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where'd they go? <laughs> the Tiki Bar. <laughs> Do that again, Steve. Do that again. Get the grip side of us. Alright, you guys see you tomorrow. Yeah. Woo. Oh. <laughs> That's a good picture. Good to see you, Bobby. <laughs> you too.
right. <laughs> Look at that, that's Barefoot Beach there. That's the southern tip of Barefoot Beach. Gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. We're going out. Yeah, we're going out fast. They're done fishing, they're going home. Yeah. <laughs> Wherever home is, I don't know what the dolphins are. Back here. Yeah. But these guys are going out. The ones in front of us are going out. Yeah, they're not done. Yeah, they they stay back here. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Old Norwegian's Pass State Park over here on the left. Our most favorite beach in the universe. Gorgeous. Anybody wishing they were out here with us? Anybody wishing they were here? It is a beautiful night, that's for darn sure, right? We gotta turn around here. Again, Barefoot Beach right there. The southern point. It used to be called the Witch's Finger down here. It had like a very distinctive hook to it, like a crooked witch's finger if you saw it from the air. But it's changed over the years. Hurricanes and tropical storms. Boy, one night we came out here and the dolphins were just going crazy all along the shore here chasing fish. There was about half a dozen of them feeding all up and down the beach here. This is the north end of Del Norwegians over here. Glorious, glorious, glorious. Look at that. Wow. going out here. We're just kind of fighting the current.
actually going backwards here. Naples.com, my friends. North Naples, Florida. Wiggins Pass. Bunch of Irish whiskey toast. Anybody care for a little, a little warmer upper? A little Irish cheer. It's open. Yeah. Oh, you have the cups out this time. Yeah. So Robert is going to be our bartender here. See that bottle? Oh, here you go. There you go. There you go. Beautiful. Look at that. Our lunch Irish whiskey sunset toast, my friends. Cheers. <laughs> the toast of Ireland. Yes. All right, let's, let's pop this top. <laughs> You might as well have one, Robert.
it's hiding behind the tree. Oh no. It's hard, my friends. We're in the boat, blowing in the wind. Here we go, we're gonna get a flash. We're gonna get the green flash. Going, going. I'm thinking I saw a little green flash there. I saw a little green flash right there. Even through the trees. And that is beautiful. Look at that sky. Wow. Glorious. So that's really where the camera wants to be at. It's tough zooming in like that. What'd you think of that slancha? That's good stuff. That's like, it's way better than that other stuff. Starts with the J. <laughs> the J word. Man. No. That's the guy that founded that lives right here in Naples. He's a friend of mine. Yeah. Slancha Irish whiskey. You can have another look. You can have another sip if you want. <laughs> Tequila, Irish whiskey. <laughs> Tequila. See, one slotch it. It's like. It's any anything. I mean, you want an Irish coffee? I like it just like that neat. A lot of folks like it on the road. Any any whiskey recipe. Like, I, I'm just, if I'm going to drink a whiskey, I like a neat period. Just, I like yeah. the flavor, I like the, the smell. Yeah. The, um, we make Baileys, my wife makes our own homemade Baileys yeah. with that, yeah. And it's, it's, yeah, it's unbelievable. Go online and you'll find, you'll find recipes to make your own Baileys. Way cheaper. <laughs> oh, what a great night. What a great night. And here we go. Heading home. Man, another great night. On the water with Boat Naples. Thanks for hanging out with me, my friends. Oh, Jay and Kay, what do you think? Good one? Thumbs up? You get a thumbs up, Jay? Yeah, amen. Awesome, huh? Right off the bat, dolphins. Isn't she a gift? Amen to Captain Sandy. Yes. The best, my friends. Boat Naples, Captain Sandy. And Southwest Florida Television. Don't forget about them. Hey, what do y'all think about our captain? Huh? Yeah? A round of applause for our captain? Come on. Dolphins right off the bat? Oh, man. You don't know how long. She spends all morning out here feeding those dolphins just to keep them here so we see them. <laughs> oh, man. family, our beach family. God bless you. All right, that's going to be it. I'll see you in the morning. God willing. Tune in live.
live from my beach walk. Hit the share button, send some stars. You know the drill, tips always appreciated. She is a treasure. Amen to that, Jay. Good one. She is a treasure. Hey, until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally ho, my friends. Tally ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rod Stan. May God bless you, your family, your friends, your fur babies, everything and everyone in your life. God bless our wonderful country. God bless America. Tally ho. Tally ho.